<laughs> it took you long enough to find me. Mm, let me guess. You already talked to Orochimaru and Hisoka, didn't you? Exactly as I thought. <laughs> well, I guess all that's left now is me. The three-headed dog. The second in command. <laughs> oh, please. Did you really think I was behind all of this? You're more foolish than you look. And trust me, I'm just the second one in command. I'm just the one that is thrown out into the field to do his dirty work. Along with the others. But you, you wanted to be nosy and get into stuff you're not supposed to. Now, tell me, what is it that you want with our organization? Do you want information? <laughs> is that what you want? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You really thought you were going to get information out of me. Pitiful. I am not going to tell you anything. But I can give you a head start to find where he is located. Oh, what's the matter? You seem more frightened of me. Even more scared. Why? Why are you scared of me? Is it because I'm a lot more powerful now? Is it because that I have the outmost control over <laughs> everyone in basically everything? In hell. I can even take you to another pocket dimension. Oh. <laughs> you don't believe me. <laughs> well. Feast your eyes on this. Well, are you surprised? Oh, trust me, I could have killed everyone in a blink of an eye by now. I could have killed you if I really wanted to. But no, I want to keep you for myself. Because I still need your power. Even if I have a lot more, I still hunger. For even more. And your power is all I need to contain my hunger. And without your power, Will, then I'm just not full. <laughs> You do tend to make me laugh, pet. But this is no laughing matter. 
I could wipe out the world within a second. Within the blink of an eye. No one would even know what happened. Not even you. So, get that thought out of your head that you think you're going to win this. Because you're not going to win anything. Anything. Nothing at all. <laughs> hmm. You just want to have a meeting with him? Hmm. And here I thought you were going to kill me. You're no fun. You're no fun at all. But I guess if you really want to talk to him, I can't let your last wish go unpresented, I guess. So, in about a few minutes, I'll let you go. I'll open a portal directly to his throne room. Yes, his throne room. After all, he is a ruler of a dimension. Well, I mean, with his power, he can make armies out of just bones. He can quite literally just grab you and crush you. Kind of like a bag of chips is what your bones would sound like in crushing inside of his skeletal hands. <laughs> I would quite enjoy looking at that. But, again, I need you alive. So, I'm not going to let that happen. Hmm? What happened to me? What happened to me? What happened to me? <laughs> Everything. Everything happened to me. I lost my mentor when I was a hero. Just because he wanted me to give peace to the whole world but then I realized with all this power that he gave me I can just take this world and put it on a collar and leash and make it mine you see I could have became a hero. Hell, I could have been the number one hero. But I chose blood. So I killed that bastard. I took his power. And now I'm the number one most wanted villain. But I guess, mm, I guess, you could say I have a soft spot for you, pet. Enough blabbering from me. I'm getting tired anyway. <sighs> I shall open that portal for you, so you can go talk to him. But just remember, if he tries to kill you, that's out of my league. <laughs> so go on, hurry up. I don't want to look at your face anymore. And plus, I have to keep my strength up. 
for the next time I see you, pet. For it may be the last time I see you. <laughs> <laughs> bye bye have a nice talk and remember you call him by his name Eins Al Gould